Meanwhile, Blair rules the right bank, storming the shops and consuming the classics, and sampling sugary snacks like a modern Marie Antoinette. But we hear Serena's stories sizzle, while Blair's are more fizzle. Our cute waiter gave me his number. Blair, what are you doing? We said we wouldn't check Gossip Girl all summer. Summer's almost over. So, what does it say about Chuck? I couldn't be less interested. No new posts. He's been MIA since he left town this spring. And what does it say about us? Ooh la la. Paris is burning and Serena and Blair lit the match. Of course, your flame is hotter than mine. Everyone knows that the only guy who's been in my pants all summer is the tailor at Pierre Balmain. And whose fault is that? Hey, just as many guys have flirted with you, I just happen to have a thing for French waiters. And bartenders, and museum docents, anyone on a Vespa or a bicycle, or wearing Zadig and Voltaire. B, what's wrong? I thought you were having fun. I am, the best. But all summer I've been sitting in front of my favorite Manet and reading Colette in the park, hoping that I'll lock eyes with somebody who's doing the same thing as me and feeling the same thing as I am. That's really romantic. But alas, not effective. For all my efforts, I'm heading back home with a chuck-sized cloud over my head. And I don't even need to find a great love. I just want to go on one nice date. Well, then this calls for some more sense, yeah. Come on, I know a great wine bar down the street, and it happens to have a very cute bartender. So you have no idea where he is? Well, Charles didn't exactly leave town on good terms, and even when he does, he finds it best not to tell us where he's going. For our own sakes. Yeah, well, I need your help in finding him this time, and fast. He hasn't paid the mortgage on the Empire since May. That's when he left. Yeah, the well, bank says one more missed payment, he'll be in default. So these are the last records of his movements. It's uh, plane tickets, credit card charges, ATM withdrawals. Why don't you look him over and uh, maybe make a few calls? Of course. Thank you, Bruce. Thank you. We'll find him. I wanted to know if you or Blair have heard from Charles. No, and I don't expect to. It's actually decent of him leaving her alone. Yeah, poor Blair. Is she still hurting? Yeah. But she's putting up a good front. And I wouldn't worry about Chuck. Any normal summer, he's drunk on some island where polygamy's legal. Given everything that happened, it makes sense he's gone rogue.